y'all and welcome back for another video my name is Bianca also known as Dr. My Curls here on my channel I do natural hair pharmacy and lifestyle content so today's video is a follow-up from my unboxing that I did about a month ago so I wanted to come back on and just share a little bit about what fits inside of my Athena purse get your life plan it out you can go as far as you can dream edges lay this is the Athena Aspa handbag. It is a luxury black owned business and it's actually owned by a male. And over the month, I've actually had a chance to learn a little bit more about the CEO of the brand. So I'll definitely share some information that I actually thought was very interesting and actually motivated me to want to purchase more bags um, from this brand. So hopefully it'll also motivate you as well. Y'all know I love to support my own. So definitely shout out to all the black owned businesses out there. All right, so first and foremost, I want to show you all the purse. It can be worn with the top handle. You can also wear it as a crossbody, so it definitely has a lot of functionality. This is actually vegan leather, and if you want additional details on the dimensions of the purse, all of that good stuff, definitely check out the unboxing, but let's get straight into what's in my bag. So when you open it, this is kind of what it looks like. There's two compartments on the sides and then there's a zipper in the middle. So first and foremost, I have my glasses here and these would usually be on my face. Um, <laughs> I usually don't ever have my glasses in my purse, but if I did, you wouldn't be able to put a case with the glasses. It's just not enough room, but you can definitely put your glasses if you needed reading glasses. Also, I have a pack of gum. So it's a, the extra size, which I feel like we're familiar with how big this is. It fits in perfectly. I need to get some more of that. <laughs> also have a scrunchie because I always put my hair back if it gets too hot or if I need to put it up in a bun, I always want to be prepared. These are by Crown Silk. I will link it below um, as well, black owns. Then I have my mini pochette and inside of here, I have quite a few items. So I have sanitary napkins, I have a pen, Altoids or Altoids, excuse me. <laughs> Um, my Chanel mirror, double mirror, some lotion, and then I also have lip gloss. So this is kind of like the item that I grab out of my larger purse if I just need to run to the restroom or just run into the store really quick and I need to not have all of my items with me, I can just grab this and keep it going. Alright, so all of those items were on one side of the bag and now I'm going to go into the other side. So on the other side I have wipes. If you know, you know. Always keep you a pair of wipes. I feel like I've started doing this um, here recently and it definitely helps me stay fresh but it also comes in handy y'all. When you go to restrooms and they don't have any tissue left, no worries, I got you covered. <laughs> so definitely um, get you some wipes if you don't already have some. And then in the middle compartment, I have a wipe for my glasses and then also my Chanel card holder. So this um, item I did feature in my favorites for the month or for last month, but I have all of my information in here and this is a really good size as well and it fits a lot. And that's it. So it definitely fits a good amount of items. Now in this video, I chose to show you all the card holder and then the mini pochette but i've also worn a full size wallet in here um, with these items as well so you kind of can pick and choose which route you want to go but it definitely fits a good amount and the front closure zips very securely so you don't have to worry about anything falling out even though those compartments are not zipped on the outer compartments so even though there's no zipper here you're still good to go I've had it for a month I've worn it quite a few times I find myself grabbing this a lot it's a staple color it's black with gold accent which I love a gold on black not too fond of silver bags um, what I learned about the brand that I wanted to share with you all about the CEO specifically he was on live earlier today and he was just sharing which I love how transparent he is um, he was just sharing like new designs he was thinking about and so come to find out y'all he hand designs all of his bags yes draws them on paper sketches them out decides what design is going to go where 
where the logo is going to go, what the clasp is going to look like, the handles, the colors, the details, every single thing. And what I've learned about his brand, like this particular bag is actually sold out. And I'm not sure if he's going to bring this one back, but the way that he explained it on the live is pretty much he has drops. So when the drops release, girl, you better grab it while you can, okay? So now that we know that, y'all, listen, say less. I'm about to be on it. Like he, he's really good on social media with announcing new releases, new bags, new designs, like 100% transparent, which I really appreciate that. And you can really see the passion behind it. He has an eye for bags for women. Like, child, listen. So this bag is just beautiful. The leather is very soft, but it's also very sturdy. Um, the purse itself is functional. Again, you can take these straps off or you can keep them on, which I don't think I've shared with y'all, but I'm a crossbody girl. I don't really wear my bag's top handle just because I feel like I always want to just be able to have my bag on me and not have to actively be carrying it. Um, also, oh, I forgot. My phone would go on that, but I'm actually <laughs> recording to the right on my phone. So, sorry, I don't have my phone in here, but I forgot to show y'all that my phone would also fit in here with those items. So, I have an iPhone 13 Pro Max, and it will definitely fit in here as well. Sorry, I forgot to add that item. Um, but, overall, absolutely impressed. Love the brand, love the bag so far. Definitely shout out to him for all the moves that he's making. He does have some really, really dope designs coming out, y'all. Like, I'm so excited. I can't wait for him to drop. Not going to tell y'all the tea. Y'all got to wait. Y'all got to wait. But I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Just wanted to show you all what fits inside the bag. In the future, I'm going to do a what's in my bag and unboxing all in one video um, just because I feel like they kind of go together. So my apologies for not doing this one originally when I unboxed the item. But... Please go look at the unboxing, the packaging on these to die for y'all. Like I was sold with the packaging and I still have the box to this day in my closet. So I appreciate good packaging and good quality bags. And this is definitely that. I know this brand is very low key. You probably have not heard of Athena and that's fine. You know what I mean? That's why I'm here to spread the good news. So definitely check out the brand. Purchase a bag, let them know Dr. My Curl sent you. And I appreciate y'all so much. If you made it to the end, make sure you give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. And I will see you guys on my next one. I've been out of my head, can't get out of bed. Too much on my brain, but got it good, can't complain. It's like I'm losing my mind, and time's hard to find. What's a girl gotta do to catch a break up? When life tries to 